What's up guys, it's Darkin 45 here and today we'll be showing you guys how to optimize and fix the stutters and lags for Hogwarts Legacy. Now the first thing you'd want to do is open up your Steam and make sure that your, your game is already set to your fastest drive. What I'll be doing is go to manage or no sorry properties and going to my local files making sure this is on your ssd or the fastest drive you have installed on your system once that's done you are basically one step out of the three now the next next step is by going to your windows security then you'll be going to apps and browsers or browsing control then you'll be going all the way to exploit protection go to exploit protection hit that and make sure your C, your control flow guard is shut off. Now to make this, to make sure this stays off and doesn't come back up, you can do an extra layer by adding the flow guard for Agor's legacy in this column. Now I'll be going into edit, but what we'll be doing is showing you guys how to do so. So you can choose by exact file path and it will go ahead and finding where the game is stored. So for this, let's go back to the beginning by going to Steam, going there, going to product 86, and then going to looking for Steam. Click Steam, then look for Steam apps, go there and then common, and then you should find the Hogwarts Legacy, hit that. Once you hit that, it will pop up with this here, and all you need to do is scroll down and turn off the flow control full guard which is cfg and turn it off which just make sure it stays off now the third and final step is by going into your graphic settings now what i did i am using the amd graphics card i will be basically leaving a link to the um to the file or the page that i've got some of these settings for that will help you out in getting better fps so or actually minimizing your starters now, the first thing you want to do is go into the graphics card itself and make sure you have the settings. Now, I have all these shut off. I have multi sampling disabled, the graph disabled there. We have anti aliasing filtering off, extra for performance, and everything as I have, just all these setups. And this should help you out in your game performance. Now, that's basically it for today's video. All you need to know. By just following these exact steps if you guys need to um see what i did just pause the video and follow these exact steps until you get there but that's it for today's video hit the like button and subscribe for more content see you guys peace